Hey guys in this video we're gonna be checking out the top 5 best teapots, that are available on the market for their true quality. I made this list based in my personal opinion and hours of research and have listed them based on popularity, quality, price, durability, user opinions and more. If you want to see more information in the updated price you can check out the description below and also make sure subscribe for more reviews ok so let's get started with the video. Starting at number 5. We have the Primula Japanese Tesubin Stainless Steel Infuser. The Primula Japanese Tesubin Cast Iron Teapot is our editor's choice for a variety of reasons. It looks fantastic, and like a rustic piece of Chinese or Japanese pottery has been modernized to suit your kitchen. It has a big capacity and though the design is simple, this makes things like cleaning far more easy. This teapot comes with a 34 ounces capacity and it is made out of cast iron and 304 stainless steel. It is reliable and food safe, as well as being designed to heat tea evenly so you don't have to worry about whether it has brewed properly. This has a tea infuser included. It sits in the middle of the pot and is very easy to use. You just need to add the tea leaves you want, put some hot water in and let it brew. If you aren't happy for any reason, it also comes with a 30-day returns policy so you can send it back to the manufacturer. Simplicity in terms of use is one of the key reasons this is so highly recommended. Not only is making tea a breeze, it is very easy to clean this out after use. Moving on at number 4, we have the Swiss 220.102 Porcelain Teapot, 40-ounce teapot. The Swiss 220.102 Porcelain Teapot is a simple and effective teapot providing lots of different options when it comes to colors. The design is so simple that it is sure to look good in your kitchen no matter what the decor in your home is like. The Swiss option is made out of porcelain. This is very common for a lot of the simple designs of teapot. It has an excellent capacity of 40 ounces, so you can make tea for a group of people easily. The lid has a clever lip catch so as you pour with the D-shaped handle it doesn't come off and cause a spillage, or potential burn risk. There is a warranty in place if you buy this teapot, you can get a free replacement if yours breaks. However, it should be okay, the porcelain used is chip resistant and if you treat this teapot right you can use it for many years. It's a bit heavy and bulky, especially when full of liquid. If you want a teapot to take camping or on trips with you then this might be too heavy, but for home use it is ideal. At number 3, we have the Plus Soleil Square Glass Teapot. A lot of people are not just looking for the best teapot, they are looking for a teapot that doesn't cost a huge amount of money. For this, the Plus Soleil Teapot can be a great option, with a very interesting look and a capacity suitable for brewing fairly big batches of tea. The glass look is a cool design feature, but it also lets you see inside so you can tell when your tea is ready. The infuser inside is visible from the photo, this is where you place your tea before pouring in the boiling water. The materials are different from some of the other options, borosilicate glass is combined with a steel infuser. It has been handmade and though the material isn't as hardy as some of the other options it can withstand temperature changes from minus 20 degrees to 130 degrees Celsius. The Plus Soleil is also great for taking out and about with you and using in a variety of circumstances, you can use it on a camp stove or in a microwave just as easily as on the kitchen stove. At number 2, we have the Tea Bloom Princess of Monaco Teapot and Blooming Tea Gift Set. With a name so fancy, the Tea Bloom Princess of Monaco Teapot better be something special. This is a very clever design that has some authentic and old-fashioned features, it is based on European designs that heat the tea up, or keep it warm, with a tea light underneath. This gives a very interesting and classy look as well as being functional. The tea within stays warm until you are ready to drink it. As well as loose leaf tea to go within the infuser, this has free tea flowers that are designed to go into the teapot to give an extra infusion. This glass tea kettle is safe to be heated up on the stovetop if this is how you wish to brew your tea. It has a large capacity of 34 ounces, enough for making tea for plenty of people. One of the best things about it is the extremely elegant design. To be able to enjoy flowering tea is something very special and a great way to entertain your guests at a tea party. This is quite a big design, not the best if you want a compact teapot. 
The clever features such as the vented lid, heated tea light section and the comfort handle make this a very well-designed teapot for every different type of user. And finally at number 1, we have the Suika Japanese Tesuban Cast Iron Teapot Tea Kettle Pot. This teapot looks like it could have been made at any time in history. TOWA Workshop Japanese Tesuban Cast Iron Teapot. Because it is cast iron, you can even enjoy the old-fashioned way of making tea, you can brew your tea over a fire or in the backyard on the grill. There are many ways of brewing or serving tea in a teapot like this, and something satisfying about the rustic design. This is modern in the way it is made though. The clever steel tea infuser allows you to easily put tea leaves inside and brew tea for a group of people. Be warned that you aren't supposed to fill over 3 quarters s as this can cause spillage. The 22 ounces, 650 milliliters design is a good size for groups and families, but there are many sizes available and the manufacturer has every different household's needs covered. You can get a smaller option if you're just brewing tea for yourself. It's an incredibly durable option due to the cast iron design. Naturally, only food grade materials are used in the construction. The even heat provided by the cast iron design is good for brewing slowly, and this can extract more flavors from some different varieties of tea. Thanks you for watching guys, I hope you liked this video if this video is helpful to you. Please make sure like comment and subscribe, if you have any question related to this product you can leave a comment down below. I will get back to you as soon as possible.